Sean's time in a Suns uniform. What a spark plug he is for that team. So they are sorely missing his energy. Credit to a crescendo, averaging nearly 32 points per game. Cut his hair and got younger. <laughs> I'm telling you, he's had long hair. And he seems to be even faster now. Seems like a lifetime ago that these two teams met. Way back early in the season as Shea Crowder. Delivers the three-point connection. Fox is a problem. Uh, he has been playing tremendous basketball. He can not only score on you, he'll get you in foul trouble as well. Book sets up Barnes. And the rainbow connection from Booker. They're with the same size, ability to move without the ball and shoot from all angles. Barnes trying to get him off the snide, able to do so. Gets a soft touch to go down there. See Mo Harkless extended the defense there on Booker. Skip pass far side, Paul slips it into the corner to Mikhail Bridges. Three ball corner pocket, yes. Book fires it down low to Crowder who does a nice job of handling. Five on the shot clock, Book from long range, yes. But the difference between Sacramento and Houston is you let down on Sacramento, they'll have you down 20. Uh, they can get hot quickly. You cannot take them for granted. It was evident he was intense on making it a one game issue as good looking shot there from the rookie Tyrese Halliburton and spits out Dario coming off of his first double figure game since three straight in late March Halliburton baseline pull up got it and I remember we were a month five weeks into the season and Chris Paul was still irritated the Suns lost that first game to the King rip that ball away and see if it'll work final five seconds right Trying to do this one on his own and does so successfully. Keeping the Kings off the line, only two attempts for them. Chris Paul out on the floor with Javon Carter, Cam Johnson, Torrey Craig, Dario Sharks, Javon Carter, baseline pull up. Yeah, and he, he's, I think he's pretty much entrenched himself back into the rotation. Had nine points and a win on Dario tied up there. Carter lets it fly from deep and makes the connection. Last five games, he's better than 44%. Yeah, he's like, look at me now. Don't look at me back then. Right. Tough runner for Fox. Dario stays with it. Carter, right wing, deposits the triple. <laughs> Timeout, Sacramento. We knew he could score. Right. But not to that level. I mean, he just had one of those unconscious nights. Yeah, I remember with Tony, 10-point Phoenix lead, led by as many as a dozen. Harrison Barnes got off to a solid start, gets the contact there on Sharch, the finish, and the foul. Here on this current eight-game losing skid, they've had a nine-game losing skid. They've dropped five straight on the road. It's just really hard to know what to make of this team and, and they come in tonight currently 12th in the West. Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's really surprising uh, because when they did go on that run that you're talking about, the second one, everyone thought, okay. Including the loss the other night against the Wizards. As Heald slips across the lane, finds the open shooter Barnes. Can't leave him. Torrey Craig, you should know better on that one. Harkless started the last five games now. Had just two in the loss the other night as D.A. put back over Harkless. Phoenix possession. Book off the inbound. I love not a bounce play that works, man. Fox showing off the speed right there. Takes it right to the cup. I don't know. You call that speed or you call it something else. Faster than speed. I didn't see him. Cameron Payne flashing his own set of wheels. Continues to carve his way up in the standings. Nice angle pass there from Cameron Payne. San Antonio, Golden State, when they were in the midst of their hot streak, is Cameron Payne puts the left hand out in front of white side like bait and runs it right up off the window. The NBA teams aren't used to playing zone. The Kings went into a little zone and can't. Have caught fire. Wright has played well off the bench as well. And another indicator as he's got a dozen. 
Ting shot 72% in that second quarter as CP3 sets it up top. DA time to eat. Sun shot 62% in the half, better than 52% from deep. But this guy, after missing his first five, has caught fire. You talk about the old home feeling. Luke Walton may have maybe CP catch lightning in a bottle with Damian Jones, who was just signed earlier in the week as Book knocks down the little 12-footer. Jones had five points, four rebounds in that lost Wednesday. He signed a couple of 10-day deals with the Lakers. And <laughs> You're just sitting there and the guy trips on you. Just because my fault. feet happen to be bigger than yeah. his. I mean, <laughs> boy, tough finish there from De'Aaron Fox. Mm -hmm. Well, and he's learning to get him open. I mean, that's the beautiful part of the big guy. If you set a good screen, more chance to, more times than not, you're going to get the ball. to run the guy off of you instead of you trying to lean one way or another to pick him off and pick up a foul. Well, that's a, the thing, and I know you talk about this so often, but in that screen game, his heel hits a high arching corner, throws it out to the open shooter, Crowder. DA keeps it alive. Great hustle from the big man. A rocket pass from Chris Paul inside the bridges for an easy two. Because he has been an issue for teams in the fourth quarter. Yeah, their bench has played surprisingly well as D.A. muscles that one up over heel. Three on the shot clock. Fox trying to turn the corner. Booker cuts him off. Forces him back into a tough shot. And De'Aaron Fox knocks it down. And his effort helps him even exhibit it even more. Book inside. Harkless blocks that one away. Sets up numbers here for the Kings. Halliburton stops beyond the strike. Low attempt. Looked like he got bumped from white side. No foul call. Here's Fox using that speed. Crowder too late to get a hand on it. Maybe caught the top of Fox's head. As he's showing the lingering effects. And Cameron Payne going right into the land of the giant. Aiton feet up top. It was Bridges with the alley. D.A. with the U. Booker working on Metu into the corner, pass stolen away by Barnes. Halliburton slamming on the brakes, and the second triple that he's hitting, 30 points per game. They are dead last in bench scoring, but they've got 35 here tonight. Halliburton where the ball fake, runs it up, and up top, Metu goes and gets it. Final minute of the third quarter. Three point Phoenix lead. Campaign on the drive with a High kiss off the window. Been yeah, short. Yeah, that's why no goal is in. Yes. Halliburton gets up in the air, turns it over. Cameron Payne up ahead of the streak, and Cameron Johnson and Cam slam. Kings matching their biggest lead is Cam Johnson again with a strong drive and finish. Has been hot himself. He could have taken that shot. Halliburton left all alone. Had plenty of time to step into it. Carter's got it. Up ahead to Craig. Sidesteps the rookie. Takes it in for the easy two. Carter sees an opening. Collects the ball. Frames up the defender. Takes it glass. Devin Booker, DeAndre Ayton remain on the bench. Corey Craig gets the open look and knocks it down from deep. Probably going to go in. I mean, that's just how consistent he has been. Fox inside on Cam Johnson. Great defense from Cam, but just better offense from the slippery De'Aaron Fox. Bye -bye. Paul finds the opening, kicks it, corner shooter. Mikhail Bridges won't get it. Paul with the back tap. Up top, D.A. Timeout, Sacramento. Suns with their starting five back on the floor. Chris Paul works inside, gets Fox on his hip. Suns looking for a 10th straight win here at home. Fox gets the contact and the foul. Chris Paul inside to Aiton. Barnes defending. DA facing up. You gotta Cash it pay. in. Yeah, you man, you got to be offended by that. Continue. To pile them up. Suns won it. Despite a terrific fight from the Kings who took a